Good morning. This week we're going to study another poet. Vamos a estudiar otra poeta, Ruby Carr. There she is. Uh, Ruby Carr, nacida en Punjab, India, que está aquí. Y su familia se mudó a Toronto, que está al norte de nosotros, en Canadá, cuando era niña. Uh, ella escriba poemas um, y se hizo famosa por el um, Instagram. Yeah. So here are some of her poems. Let me show you a video of one. Vamos a mirar un video. I don't know what living a balanced life feels like. When I am sad, I don't cry, I floor. When I am happy, I don't smile, I glow. When I am angry, I don't yell, I burn. The good thing about feeling in extremes is when I love, I give them wings. But perhaps that isn't such a good thing, cause they always tend to leave. And you should see me when my heart is broken. I don't grieve, I shatter. Um, okay, quita su poemas, right? Uh, eso es, se llama Primera Generación de Inmigrantes. No tienen idea de lo que es perder un hogar a riesgo de nunca encontrar casa de nueva, tener toda tu vida dividido entre dos tierras y convertirse en un puente entre dos países. And you can see she also always draws pictures. We'll look at these a little bit more. Uh, tomorrow. There's one other video I want you to see of, she reads her poems to packed houses and she took a trip back to India. Um, so let's just look at that. Two months ago, we landed in India, toured across the country. Two months ago, we landed in India. Toward and we'll put subtitles in español para que entiendes. Two months ago, we landed in India, toured across the country, got to meet some amazing readers. Scratch that. We got to meet a lot of amazing readers, had the dopest all-women security team, hopped on a train, a rickshaw, even had an emergency landing. Did I mention I brought my dad on tour? He made his first ever boomerang. We ate all the street food, played holy with some cool Canadians, went home to my village in Punjab, hung out at the house with my family, strolled around, made some tea, spent time with my grandfather. Isn't he handsome? Then the village elder surprised me with the realest of homecomings and I got an award. Check it, it says star writer. I was accompanied by the greatest team a girl could ask for. Rocky, Nabil, I love you. Thank you for tolerating me. The love I got from you all was unreal. I love each and every one of you. Thank you for embracing the poetry. I'm gonna miss you. You make me feel like the luckiest woman alive and I'm already counting the days till I come back. Two months ago, we landed in India, toured across.